All good to go now. They're off. And Supermo a little bit slowly out of the gates there from stall number one. And next to him, Comusica needs chasing along in the very early strides. Lens Legacy is the rank outsider of this field, but leads up early, heading towards the judge for the first time. Here's Burdett Road on the outside, followed by Comusica and French Invasion just in behind those in fourth place. Supermo, after that slow start, has switched to the outside of the field and now making progress into the bend, just moving a fraction ahead of French Invasion into fourth place. A little respect comes next. Storm Valley is last but one. And last of all is Barrel Aged as they now race around the turn and head onto the far side of the track for the first time. All the time, Supermo making inroads into the leader. And that leader is still Lens Legacy. Lens Legacy, a neck in front. Supermo, though, right there now, on his shoulder in second place. In third is Burdett Road. The pace just looks steady, nothing more spectacular than that with Comusica on the inside. In behind those is a little respect. French Invasion just showing signs of inexperience are on the outside and then Barrel Aged and the back marker Storm Valley as they move on then, passing the midpoint down the back straight and in just over a furlong's time, they'll be turning back towards home. From this point though, they've got five and a half furlongs left to run and the leader's Lens Legacy still. Looks as though Jamie Spencer's quite happy to just get a trail from the rank outsider. Jamie aboard Supermo in second place, who has that eye-catching form behind Dubai Mile here from last year. He's second still and going comfortably. On the outside, Burdett Road now makes a move and forces Supermo to go with him. And these two sweep on by Lens Legacy with half a mile left to go. French Invasion right in behind them as well. He's about to go into third place, followed by Com Musica and Storm Valley. Then comes Barrel Aged, and the back marker is a little respect. Supermo has taken the advantage here. Burdett Road comes under pressure. French Invasion hasn't yet been shaken off in third place. And then in fourth is Storm Valley as they race then down towards the final two furlongs. Barrel Aged is in fifth place as they now accelerate inside the last two furlongs. Supermo has company. Here's French Invasion powering to the front here. This good-looking horse, huge gallop on him, massive stride, and he's using it to great effect, to devastating effect. It's his first run. French Invasion wins in the style of a really good horse. Supermo's weakened right out of it, but French Invasion, what a taking debut. Barrel Aged was second. Comusica came next. And then on their outside was Burdett Road, French Invasion, a sparkling start to the night. French Invasion has taken off first, in really impressive fashion. Jack Mitchell will shortly be uh, making his way back to uh, way in and way out for the next. He's got a, a nice one for the stable up next as well um, in our handicap. Jack, if I could just walk back with you. He looked yeah. the part on paper, he very much looked the part on the track as well. Oh, he's a smashing horse, I mean. See the size of him. <laughs> he just towered over every over every horse in that in that race. Um, just very green early on. He actually jumped good. The horse on my outside just sort of came across a bit quick, and he was just caught on his inside. But once got him relaxed and travelling down the back, he just followed the other two. Especially when the pace lifted, sort of four out, three and a half out. We just picked up, and when the gap came with the cutaway, he uh, he probably lengthened like no other. So no, I was impressed. On profile, that injection of pace, four out. That looked tailor-made for him. Exactly. Uh, like we weren't, go, we weren't dawdling, but we weren't going a proper gallop. And you know, a big horse like him needs to use that stride of his. And when the pace lifted, and we got stretching, sort of as we straightened, and he got into gear quite well. Chance of a double in the next for the stable? Fingers crossed. I know nothing about it. So <laughs> <laughs> maybe speak later. Well done. Watch live racing now on RacingTV.com.